Hey guys, how are you doing? And in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to read someone's mind very basically and very simply. So, let's get straight into this. So, for this thing, you will need six sheets of paper, three for you, three for your partner, and two pens. So, there's your pen, and there is your three sheets of paper. Or you could do this with one, but three makes it easier. Right, so to start with, you need to think of three questions before. I recommend a boy's name, a girl's name, and a number. Once you know exactly what your three questions are, you ask your partner, or whoever's mind you're about to read, for the first question. But you don't answer the first question, you answer the last question. So, for example, if we said a boy's name, a girl's name and a number. We'll use them as our three examples. So I'll ask our part my partner for a boy's name, but I will write a number. Now this can be any number, just a random number, because the mission is to get two out of three here. That is the mission. So, you write down any number. So, it goes like this. A boy's name. Once that is done, you get the person to either put it where you can see it, or, or say it out loud. So put it there where I can see it. Right? And then you keep yours secret. So then you ask for a girl's name, but you write down what they have already written. Right. So you'll then get them to either put that piece of paper where you can see it, or where, and they get you to tell them. So put it where I can see it. Now, as your final question, you will ask for a number, which you answered first, but they don't know that. So, this is where, this allows you to get two out of three minimum, because you get to see both the boy's name and the girl's name. So, write down a number. Right, so, by coincidence, I managed to get three out of three here. So... I wrote Matt down, right, so I'll go through what I did. I, when I asked for a boy's name, I wrote down the number 10, just any number, first number that came to my head. Well, that's when he wrote Matt's down. So, that, when I asked for a girl's name, that's when I wrote Matt, which allowed me to get that one correct. Once that has been done, I ask for a number and once that has been done I write down Poppy and that is how you can get two out of three on reading someone's mind so guys that is it for today's video I do hope you enjoyed if you do like this video and want to see more things like this comment down below yes and if you've got your own ideas comment them down below as well and if we do your idea we will give you a shout out on the video Apart from that, don't forget to subscribe with notifications on to see our next upload. Goodbye.